Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to another video or welcome if this is your first video. Today we will be building HMAS Success, which is an endurance class multi-product replenishment oiler. That is quite a, that is quite a mouthful to say. So in this tutorial we'll be building this ship layer by layer. Um, this is quite a complex tutorial just because of the amount of stuff that's on the deck of the ship itself. But uh We'll get through it. So, besides from that, um, what we're going to where we're going to start. If you want the dimensions, that is linked in the description. Uh, we're going to be starting two, four, five. We're going to be starting five deep in the water, but it does sit six deep because the propellers are just one block lower. But we're going to be starting at five deep for this tutorial. So, when I build this first, uh, the black layer down below. I'm going to, like the sort of black section here down here, I'm going to be building that out of white. And besides from that, um, anything else worth mentioning? Um, if you want, there are some j janky areas of the ship, like, I should probably say that now, uh, like the back end down here. Uh, just, this is an older, this was a ship I built back in the 360, and I've just been slowly touching it up. So a lot of the layers here at the front are pretty repetitive with the angle, but for the most part, it does the job. So, uh, besides from that, let's jump into this tutorial. Okay, so we're going to start five deep in the water. So what we're going to start off by doing is, I'm going to do this out of white, but you're going to do this with black. I'm just going to do it out of white so you can see what I'm doing. So we're going to start off by putting down a line of six, so we're going to go two, four, six two four six and then we're going to have two fours two four two four so we've got six four four and then we're going to have two sets of two so we've got two and then a two so we've got six four four two two and then we're going to have two sets of three so we're going to have three and then a three and then we're going to have a hundred and three going back so we're going to go two four six 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, 100, 2, 3. So for me, I'm just going to line this up real quick, make sure I haven't missed a block, because the first layer is always crucial to make sure you don't stuff it up. So this is what we have so far. What we're going to do next is we're going to go in, and we're going to have 11 going back. So we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11 and then we're going to have a 2 we're going to go in again and have 2 so we've got 103 11 and then 2 we're going to change direction and we're going to go 2 in so we've got we got a 2 and then we're going to have another 2 and then a 1 and that 1 should be your center line straight down the middle all the way to the end so now that we have that uh, I'm just going to figure out, just remember which which one it's on. It's on, just got to check some. So it's on the first two going in. Okay, so we're going to need a counting block. So I'm going to grab yellow. And we're going to go to here pretty much. And we're going to go back eight. So we're going to go two, four, six, eight. I'm going to add one, one white. Well, for you it'll be black, but I'm just going to say white for the rest of the tutorial so I don't mix myself up. Okay, next we are going to have seven, two, four, six, seven, and then we're going to have two. So it'll be like that. So we got eight, one, seven, and then two. I'm going to cut out our counting blocks, like so. And then what you're going to do is you're going to copy this to the other side and then just fill all of this in with black, but I'm going to do it with white. And then once you've done that, we'll get on to the next layer. 
Okay, so this is what you should have. What we're going to do next is we're going to come down to the front. We're going to come forward one, and that one is going to be by itself. Then we're going to have a nine. So we've got one, nine, two, four, six, eight, nine. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Yep. So we've got one, nine, and then we're going to have a four, two, four, and then we're going to have two twos. So we're going to two, and then a two. So we've got one, nine, four, two, two, and then we're going to have two threes. Three and a three. Then we're going to have a six. Two, four, six. And then we're going to have a 98 going back. So we're going to two, four, six. Oh, hold on. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-six, thirty-eight. 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98. And it should be directly in line with that last one there. Okay, now we're going to have 11. So we're going to have an 11, so we're going to have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. And then we're going to have a 2, and then a 1, and then we're going to have two 2s going in. So we've got 2 and a 2, so it should look like that. It should go 2, 1, 2, 2, and then a 1. And then we're going to come back to here, and we are going to go back 10. So we're going to have 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Like so. On this two, we're going to add two on top, one behind to make that a three. So it'll be like that. We're going to add two sandstone blocks going out from the end of that run there. And we're going to put a staircase on top. And then an upside down staircase on top of it. And then an upside down one here. Right side up one here. We're going to go underneath. I'm going to put an upside down one going there. And a right set up one going like that. Actually, hold on, opposite way. So it'll be like that. Then right side up, upside down. So it has that pattern. And then we're going to do that again. We're just going to do that from here. We're going to go. We're going to go upside down one, and then we're going to flip around, put another upside down one, and then right side up, right side up. Like that. I'm going to do that on this side as well. Except for we're just going to do the opposite of this one. So we're going to have right side up. Flip around. Right side up. And then upside down ones underneath it. So it should make this sort of pattern. Once you've got that, you're going to copy this to the other side. And we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so this is what you should have. What we're going to do next is we're going to head down to the front. We're going to put one on top of the previous one that we just put down at the start. And then we're going to go nine. So I'm going to go two, four, six, eight, nine. And then we're going to have a four. And then we're going to have two twos. And then two threes. And then a six, two, four, six. So it's literally the previous layer. And then a 98 to the end. And we know since the last one was 98, it's going to be the exact same. So it's just going to pretty much end in the same line as the last layer. Well, it's going to end about there. And then we're going to have 11, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. And then a 3. So we've got 11, 3, 1, 2, and then a 2, and then a 1. Now, for the propellers on the last layer, that's what you want them both to look like. You want them both to go in the same direction. You don't want them opposite. Now, what I missed on the last layer, you're going to put one block on the side here, one on the side here, and on this side as well. On this layer, you're going to put one on top here, 
one on top here, uh, just on the other side for now. And then you're going to put three on this, on the tower rudder. And once you got that, you're going to copy that to the other side, and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so this is what you should have. What we're going to do next is we're going to come down to the front. We're going to put one on top of that one again. And then we're going to go eight. We're going to go two, four, six, eight. And then we're going to have a four. So we've got one, eight, four. And then we're going to have two twos. So we're going to have two and a two. So I'm going to have three sets of three. So we're going to have one, two, three. So we got one. One eight four two two three three three, and then we're gonna have a four, two four, and then we're gonna have a ninety eight. Now, because the previous one was ninety eight, we're just gonna drag this directly in line with the last, the previous layer. Just gonna run this back. And it will start there, pretty much, where the previous one did. Okay, next thing we're going to do is we're going to go in and we're going to have 11, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 11. And then we're going to have, I think I'm missing a number. Let me just check. Oh no, no I'm not. Okay, next, then we're going to have a 2. So we're going to have 11 and then a 2 and then another two, and then a one. We're going to wrap around going in. We're going to have two, and then a two, and then a one, like that. So it'll be two, two, one, two, two, one. I'm going to put one on top of this one, three on top of this one, like that. And now that we have that, we're going to copy that to the other side, and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so the next two layers are relatively easy. So what we're going to start off by doing is we're going to come down to here. We're going to go over this gap. So we're going to be about there. And this is going to go back five. So I'm going to go two, four, five. So I've got a five. And then we're going to have a three. And then a four. So I've got five, three, four. And then we're going to have two sets of two. So we've got two, two. And then we've got three threes. Three, three, three. So we've got five, three, four, two, two, three, 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 and then a four. And then we're going to have a 98. A 98 going back. So this will go straight to the end. So this layer should sit directly on the surface of the of your water, pretty much. So your water should be off to the side of this. So we've got 98. Now we're going to go 13. So we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. So we've got 13. And then we're going to have an 8. So we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8. And then we're going to go in again. We're going to have two sevens. So we're going to go two, four, six, seven. And then a two, four, six, seven. So we've got 13, eight, seven, seven. And then we're going to have a five. So we're going to go two, four, five. And then a one. And going in, we're going to have three. So it'll be like that. So we've got 13, eight, seven, seven. Five, one, three, and then if you run a line forward, this should be your center line all the way to there. What you're going to do next is you're just going to pretty much cover this up. So it's going to pretty much fill in all this negative space and just pretty much all of this will be underwater. But, well, this will, this layer will be on the surface level of the water, just so, yeah, so pretty much your water will be, your water line will be about here. Okay, now that you've done that, you're going to copy that to the other side, 
and once you've done that, we're going to head back to the front and we're going to go down to where we got this five. We're going to skip three and we're going to place two. So we should have a gap of three at the front and then we're just going to pretty much build over the top of the previous layer all the way going back to the end. So I'm just going to run this all the way back. So this is just going to run back all the way to the end and wrap around. It's just going to wrap around here, wrap around here, 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 and three in there. And then you're going to copy that to the other side and that completes this layer. And that in a sense completes the black section underneath the water and the black line on top of the water. So let's get on to the gray section. Okay, so this is what you should have so far. What we're going to do next is we're going to come down to the front here. We're going to put one on the front and then on the front of that, we're going to put a staircase. So we've got one block here with a staircase on the front. Then we're going to have a three. So we've got one, three, and then a four, two, four. So we've got one, three, four. And then we're going to have two twos, two and a two. And then we're going to have three threes. So three, three, three. And then we're going to have a four. So we've got two. We got, sorry, we got a one, a, a one, three, four, two, two, three, 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 four, and then a 99. So we're going to go 99 pretty much. So we're going to run this one back. Actually, we'll just count it out. So we've got one, two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, 99 to there. Then we're going to have 13, 2, 4, 6. 8, 10, 12, 13. So we've got 13. And then we're going to have an 8, 2, 4, 6, 8. Then two sevens, 2, 4, 6, 7, 2, 4, 6, 7. So we've got two sevens and then a 5, 2, 4, 5, a 1, and then a 3 going in. And you're going to copy that to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so what we're going to do next is we're going to come down to the front above this staircase. We're going to put one, and then I'm going to put staircase in front again. And then we're pretty much going to go, so we've got our one, and then we're going to go three again, and then a four. So we've got one, three, four, and then two, two. So we've got one, three, four, two, two, then three threes. Three, three, three. And then we're going to have a four, two, four. And then this run is going to be 100 back. So the last one was 99 and we're one block overhang. So we're going to head straight to the back and it's going to stop directly with the previous layer. So it's pretty straightforward. It should just only overhang by one at the front. But at the back, we'll stop directly in line with there. Then we're going to have a 13. So I'm going to 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. And then an 8, 2, 4, 6, 8. Then two sevens, 7, 7. And then this one is going to be a 6. So I'm going to 2, 4, 6. And then this one's going to be 4 going in. So I'm going to have 2, 4 to the center, like so. And then we're going to grab our slabs. We're going to put three upside down ones there. 
three upside down ones there. Three upside down ones there. Three here. So we got what one, two, three, four. Four sets of three slabs in those corners. And then this front one is going to be five. So I'm going to go two, four, five. So five slabs there. Three, 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 three. And then what you're going to do next is you're just going to copy that to the other side. And we'll get on with the next layer. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to come to the front. We're going to put one on the front again. And then behind it, we're going to go back three. And then we're going to go four, two, four. So one, three, four. Then we're going to have two twos, two, two. And then we're going to have three sets of three again. Three, three, three. And then a four, two, four. And then we're going to have 114 going back. So I'm going to go two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, <clears throat> 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, 100, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 14. So it's 114. It should stop directly in line with there. We're going to go in. We're going to have an 8, 2, 4, 6, 8. Then we're going to have a 7, 2, 4, 6, 7. Another 7, 2, 4, 6, 7. And then we're going to have a 5, 2, 4, 5. And then a 1, and then a 4. Like that. So all we have left is four slabs and a staircase. So we're going to come up to here. We're going to put one slab in here at the very front, at the very long run. So we've got one there, one here, here, and here. So we've got four slabs, one, two, three, four. And then on the very front, we're going to have an upside down staircase. And then you're just going to copy that to the other side. Uh, when we get to the numbers, by the way, we'll build up, we'll build up to about probably around there. So we'll get that top bit there done, and then we'll put the numbers on. Or at least I'll show you how to do it. Okay, so copy this to the other side, and we'll continue on. Okay, so continuing on, we're going to head down to the stairs. We're going to put down one above that stair. Then we're going to have two threes, so we have three, three, so we've got one, three, three, and then two sets of two, so two, two, and then three sets of three, so three, 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 like so, and then we're going to have two sets of four, four, and a four, so we've got one, three, 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 two, two, three, 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 four, four, and then we're going to have a run of a hundred going back. So we're going to two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, 100. So 100, should it overhang? I don't think it should. I think I've overcounted. So I'm pretty sure 100, oh no, it overhangs. It should overhang by one, pretty much, with in line with this, pretty much. Should it just overhang? Okay, now going in, we're going to have 12, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 
and it should end there. And then we're going to have an 8, 2, 4, 6, 8. Then two sevens, two, four, six, seven, two, four, six, seven. And then we are going to have a six, two, four, six. And then going in, we're going to have a five, two, four, five to the center. We're going to grab our slabs. We're going to put three slabs in here. So I've got one there, three here, one, two, three, three here. One, two, three, and then one, two, three. So we should have four sets of three slabs on the back. And then this one is going to be seven. So we're going to go two, four, six, seven. We're going to head down to the front. And we're going to have one slab here, one here, one here, one here, 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 here. here. Yeah, just pretty much, except for here. This is the only place we're not going to have a slab, and then the front one's going to be a staircase. And now that we have that, you're going to copy that to the other side, and once you've done that, we will continue on. Okay, so this is what we should have so far. What we're going to do next is we're going to come down to the front. We're going to put down our one on top of the staircase, and then we're going to have a three. So I've got one, three, and then we're going to have two, 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 and a two. So one, three, two, two. Then we're going to have a three. So we've got our one, our three, two, two, three. And then we're going to have a two. And then we're going to have two threes. Three, three. And then two fours. Two, four, two, four. So I've got one, three, two, two, three, two, three, three, four, four. And then what we're going to do next is we're going to come down to the front. We're going to cut off this slab here at that, at that first two. And then we're going to head back here. We're going to bring this out by one. And this is going to go back 114. So I've got two, four, six, eight. 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60, 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, 100, uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. So 14 should bring it in line with here. So 114 should bring it in line with this one here. And once we have that, we're going to go in and we're going to have an 8, 2, 4, 6, 8. And then we're going to go in again and have two sevens, two, four, six, seven. In again, two, four, six, seven. And then we're going to have a six, two, four, six. We're going to go in and it's going to be six to the center, two, four, six. So we've got, once we've got our 114, we've got eight, seven, seven, six, and then six going in. What we're going to do next is we're going to come to the front and we're just going to go slab, a slab in there, slab there, 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 and a slab there, slab there on this one. And then a staircase on the front. So this will be the only one that doesn't have a slab or a staircase. Now that we've got that, what you want to do is you're going to grab your dark gray. And from where you start your 114 line, you're just going to run that across to the other side. For me, I'm just going to run it into the middle. And then going all the way to the back, you're just going to fill in with all this negative space heading back with dark gray. 
So it'd be from the from the 114 run all the way to the end. And once you've done that, well, once you've done that, we'll continue on. So let's get to it. Okay, so this is what you should have. The reality is we've probably got more than enough grey than we need. We don't really need like a decent amount of this here. But if you want to cut it out, you can. If you want to just leave it in because you can be bothered, I don't blame you. Um, next thing we're going to do is we're going to come down to the front. On top of this stair, we're going to place our block. So we've got our one. And then we're going to have three sets of two. We're going to have one, two, three. So we've got three twos. And then on the on the front of the back two, we're going to put down an iron bar, just sticking off the side of it, and we'll get we'll pretty much do the anchor in a minute. Okay, next thing we're going to do is we're going to go back, we're going to go out, and we're going to have three. Then we're going to go out again and have a two, and then two threes, three, three. So be like that: one, two, 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 three, two, three, three. And then we're going to have two fours, two, four, two, four. And then we're going to go out and we're going to have a hundred and, uh, sorry, no, we're not. We're going to have 36 going back. We're going to go two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36. So we've got 36. We go to our iron bars. We're going to have 17, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 17. So we've got 17, and then we're going to have 13 blocks 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. And then now that we have that, we're going to have 19 iron bars. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19. And then, and then, and then, we're going to have 31 going back. So I'm going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19, 20, uh, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 31 to the end. And then going in, we're just going to have two blocks. Okay, so what we're going to do now is uh, I'm just going to chuck them on for the placement here. We're going to skip this first block and we're going to put three banners. Those three banners are going to say 304, 304, and that's just for the ship number. So that's going to be where that banner is. The banners are is on this long run here. So I will link a banner tutorial in the description for um, numbers and letters also as well. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our iron bars and we're going to have five. So we're going to one, two, three, four, five. Then we're going to have one and then going in, have one. Then we're going to have another five. One, two, three, four, five. And then a one and then another one. Then we're going to have another five, two, four, five with our iron bars, and then one, one, and then another five, two, four, five, and then one block at the end, like that. So all our iron bars are five, and then we just got two pretty much there, two there, two there, one on the end. On the back side, we're going to skip. Two blocks. Uh, sorry, we're not going to skip. We're going to place two iron bars, and then a block, and then three iron bars to the center, like that. What we're going to do next is we're going to go to the inside. We're going to skip two blocks. I'm going to place one, and this is going to pretty much. We're just going to place three, and then we're just going to run this way. We're going to overhang by one, so it should pass. Should be three here. It's going to drop in, it's going to drop hours, I meant, and then gap a three here. And we're just going to pretty much do that a couple of times. So we have like a little walkway going around in here. So it should be too wide, except for on this block, um, on all of them. So this one, this one, 
this one and then the long run here we're just going to well the block on the long run we're just going to have three in those spots and then along here we're just going to run this down and when we get to the next set of iron bars i'll show you what we're going to do we'll do i'll say what we're going to do there okay so we should be about there we're just going to go past an extra we'll just go past seven so we're going to go two four six seven and then add two to the side of that like that pretty much and that should just wrap around that will just wrap around the whole ship in this section here okay now that we have that done if you want if you want to go the extra step you can just cut out random doors along here and just put in iron iron bars like just random ones in here so like boom 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 stuff like that if you want to just add in a few iron iron doors along the inside pretty much in there you can knock yourself out okay next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab our cobblestone stairs and our cobblestone slab beneath this iron bar we're going to put down a cobblestone stair and then yeah beneath that we're going to have a slab and connecting to the side of that slab we're just going to have a stair here and a stair here so it'll be like that next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab our slabs coming back here we're going to put one here one here one here 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 next to the anchor then one here and here so it's just this one that doesn't have the slab and then a staircase on the front like so and i'm just going to double check make sure i'm not missing anything which i don't think i am no i'm not okay so copy this to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer okay so this next layer is going to be a bit different so we're just going to put one here and then we're going to put two on the side of it like that and then a staircase on that center one so it'd be like that pretty much it seems a bit odd looks a bit odd to me as well is that correct that just doesn't seem right i'm just gonna have to i'm gonna have to have another look at that this does not seem right to me but i think it is yeah no it is it is it just doesn't seem right but yeah so i'm just gonna have that two there and then we're gonna have two more twos so i've got two and two so we've got three twos in total and then we're going to have a three and then a two and then two threes so we've got three two three three so we've got three sets of two a three a two two sets of three and then two sets of four two four two four and then we're going to have 37 so we're going to go two four six eight 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 37. Should be one short. I'm going to head to this middle run here. This one will be 13. So it's going to fill this in. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. We'll come back and get the iron bars in a second. We're going to come to this side here. We're going to skip this one and the one after it. This is going to be 18. So we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. And then we're going to skip 2, place 1, skip 2, place 1, skip 2, place 1, skip 2, place 1. So there should be 4 gaps in total. 4 gaps of 2 along here. And then this next area is pretty, pretty easy. So we're going to put 2 blocks on top here block on top of here block on top of here blocks on top of here and then block here block here like that just on top of those previous blocks and then we're just going to connect over the gaps with slabs like this and then we're going to have three to the center 
like that. So it's just pretty much you cover over those gaps with slabs. We're going to come back along here and do this. So we're going to skip an iron bar and then place one, skip one, place one, going along here all the way to the end. And then we don't put one in there. So the gap between the iron bars should just be a block. And we're going to do that on this one as well. So skip this one, place one, skip one, so on. And then we don't put one on that cut out, uh, that block that's cut out there. What we do next is the previous line we did on the inside. We're just going to build that up. All the way heading down. So we're just going to pretty much build this up by one. Fill in your gaps. Don't forget your gaps. And then wrap it in. And now that we have that, all we have left is our slabs. And uh, yeah, just our slabs. So we're going to have slab here, slab here, slab here, 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 here. here. And pretty much have it like that. So it's just going to sort of just casually build up along here. And now that you have that, you're going to just... Actually, before I say that, yeah, there's the slabs that we just put down if you need them. If you want to count them out, there should be, what, two, four, six, eight, nine, nine slabs in total in just spots of one. But if you... There you go, there's that if you need it. So now that we have that... Um, you're going to copy this to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer. So this is what we should have now. What we're going to do next is we're going to come down to the front. We're going to place one on top of that block again. And then we're going to put one off to the side. We're going to put a staircase on the front again, like what we did last time. We're going to cut that one out. So we've got our one block here. And then we're going to have two twos so two two so i got one two two and then we're going to have a three and then a two and then two threes three three so we got one two two three two three three and then our two fours two four and then two four and then we're going to go out again and this one is going to go back 121. So I'm going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56, 58, 60. 62, 64, 66, 68, 70, 72, 74, 76, 78, 80, 82, 84, 86, 88, 90, 92, 94, 96, 98, 100, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 21. So 121. We're then going to go in. And we're going to have four sevens going in. So we're going to two, four, six, seven, two, four, six, seven, two, four, six, seven, two, four, four, six, seven. I need to check something. Is that? Yeah, no, that's right. I was going to say, I thought they were overhanging, but they're not. Okay, we're going to go in again. And then this one is going to go in towards the center, and it's going to be six, two, four, six. So it should be like that on the back. Okay, we've got a few more things to do on this layer. So we just got this little, just got a couple slabs to put on here. So we're going to go two, four, six, eight, nine. Okay. So where we got our first run of iron bars on the front, we're going to skip this block here. And we're going to place nine. We're going to go two, four, six, eight, nine. Just with slabs, like that. 
we're going to head to the front. We're not going to... I don't think we have any slabs on this one. No, we don't. Except for at the front. We've got two at the front. So, um, one, two. We skip these two. And then on the third, we have a slab here and here. And then we got to put, we got to do some little cutout work for the OR. I just got to line that up, figure out where those are. So just bear with me one second. Two, two, three, and then it's on the two. So we got two, two, three, and then we got the two. So this one, what we're going to do is we're just going to, Sorry, I'm just going to need to double check this. I'm just going to line that up. How did I do this? <laughs> I did actually know. I know I'm missing a block or two there. Um, ba -ba -da -ba, it's on that two. Okay, so where we've got this two here, what we're going to do is we're going to cut off this slab and we're going to put two blocks beneath it. Like that. So we got two, we got the one, two, two, three, and then we got a two. And on this two, we're going to cut off the slab underneath and then just put two blocks beneath it. And then once we got that, I'm just going to put down some banner markers on this. So we're just going to put two banners, an O and an R. And then when you're done the other side, I'll just quickly build up a few of the runs here. So when you build up the other side, and then four, four, three. So we got our long run here, and then four, four, three. And what is it? I'm pretty sure it's on the four. Oh no, it's on the long run. So on the long run, oh no, wait, that's, that's the wrong run. Uh, there's the long run. So on the four, pretty much. It's going to be the third and the fourth. So on the third and the fourth, so we've got one, two. On the third and fourth, we're just going to put O, R there pretty much. Like that on this side. Um, I'm looking at the wrong spot. It's not there actually. It's going to be in here. So O, R on the second four. And that is correct, right? I'm looking at the right spot. Oh, no, I was in the right, and no, I was right back here, so it's just there. It's on the, because this is our long run that goes back all the way to the end. So where we, where we got that run, we're just going to have skip two and then OR on that. Okay, so now that we've got those marked out, um, is there anything else? Oh, yes, we do have one more thing we're going to do for this layer. And that is the deck markings on the uh, landing pad, whatever. So what we're going to need is we're going to need we're going to need white. So we're going to come to the back. We're going to skip the we're going to skip a block here and then place a white. And this is going to go forward thirty three. So we're going to go two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen. 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 33. So we're going to line a 33 there. We're going to come to the back again. We're going to add 4 to the side. 1, 2, 3, 4. Like so. And then we're going to change direction. And including this one that's here, we're going to go 6. We're going to go 6 forward. So we've got 2. Four, six, and then we're going to go out, and then we're going to have three sevens, two, four, six, seven, add again, two, four, six, seven, and then two, four, six, seven. So we remember we've got four added onto this, and then including that corner piece, we're going to have six this way, so we're just adding five pretty much to it. And then seven, seven, seven. This last seven will connect back into the um, 
center line like that. And then once we have that on this second seven from the front, right in the middle, we're going to, so it'll be on the fourth block. We're just going to run a line to the center like that. And then what we're going to do is just skip two blocks, place a block, go diagonal in, and then diagonal in again. We're going to do that on the other side. So it's just going to start making a circle there. So we've got a semicircle at the moment. And then on this seven, we're going to skip this block, place one white block there. And now that we have that, what you're going to do is pretty much you're going to copy this to the other side and then you're going to fill all of this from the back to the front or the negative space so all the empty gap in here with dark gray and once you've done that we'll do the numbers so i'll catch you when you've done that okay so we're going to get on to the numbers now so they're just going to be this. This is what we're going to put on. So we're going to start by we're going to start by lining them up first. So I just need to figure out it's on the four. So where we've got this second four, what we're going to do on the second block, we're just going to replace this with a white for now. And then we're going to flip over to the other side. And I just need to figure out where I put it on the other side. Uh, standard put away from that, so it's what we got. Okay, so it's on, it's two away from that, so we got one, two, and then this one will be white. Is that right? Yeah. Okay, so where that OR is, we're just going to skip one and then place white. So we're going to get this side done first. So what we're going to do first is. We're just going to grab our white for now. We're going to go put one on top. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five. On the second one up, we're going to put one at the back, at the front. We're going to go one, two, uh, was it two or three. Yeah, no, it's just two. And then now that we have that, we're going to go one, two up, and then one here. And the reason I'm doing it this way is it's a bit easier to explain rather than carving the ship up just to put on numbers. I'll show you what I mean by this. Okay, so what we're going to do next is we're going to do the zero. So we're going to skip one block and we're going to go five down. So be it like this and then month up, five up, three there. So be like that. And then we'll put on the three. So we're going to skip a block again and then three across, three going forward, five going up, three going across, Three going across here, like so. And then we just got our black to do now. So on the back of it, we're going to have one black here, one here, three here, two in here. Actually, I made a mistake. Um, this back one, does this one here, and these three aren't black. But these two are, these three are, this one is. Like that, pretty much. And this bottom one here. So that means these three. So they would have three black underneath, five black going up, three black in here. These three, one, 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 then two and two, like that, pretty much. So that's what we should have now. Now what we're going to do is since that one's already there, we're just going to break that one. We're going to break this one, make that one white, cut this one out, cut that one out white, cut this one, the block behind, make that white, do not break the slabs yet, and then so on pretty much. Then I'll just do one of the numbers for now and then I'll show you. So as you can see, we're starting to put the four on there, I accidentally broke a slab, and then we put the black on, and we're just going to pretty much do this 
for now. And I'll rebrick that one to break this one. That one. That one. That one. Okay, so that's pretty much what we should have. Now you can use dark oak or nether rack for your black. And then just use your quartz for your white. And then you're just going to, the slabs that are on the colors, you're just going to make them pretty much the color slabs that the stone ones. Make the stone ones the color slabs that are behind them pretty much. So the white will have white slabs and it'll be like that pretty much. And then you're going to continue that for these two letters pretty much. Uh, letters, uh, numbers. So you're just going to do that for the three and the zero as well. You're just going to pretty much do what we did here. And then when we go to the other side, we got to flip this around. So we got to pretty much what we're going to do is you're going to go three going forward and then five going down in total. Two there, two there. Make that the three. Skip a block and the zero. Skip a block the four. Three, four, two there, two there, two in there, one there, like that. And then we grab our black, put our black on as well. Like so. So remember, you just pretty much going to be like that on this side so this side will be just the flip so the three will be at the back the four at the front this side your three will be at the front your four at the back and it's just sort of just pretty much how it'll be and then once you've done that it'll look like this pretty much along the side of the ship just this one doesn't have slabs on it uh yours will and then once you've done that, um, I'll get back to you and I'll show you what it should look like. Okay, so this is what you should have now. It should be looking like this, pretty much. So here's the other side. I went through and did it, did it as well. So yeah, it's it's doable. So you should have three or four going this way on this side, and then three or four going this way on this side, and then your two banners at the front. So once you've got that, we can continue on with the tutorial. Okay, so now we're onto the superstructure area. So I've broken this up into three sections. We've got the bridge, the pump, the oil pump, and then the helo bay at the back. So we're going to start with the bridge. So we're going to come down to the front. What we're going to do is on top of this staircase, we're going to have two going out to the side like that. We're going to cut out the middle one, replace that with a slab like so and then we got our one here what we're going to do is we're going to come diagonal one and then go out again and have two so it's going to be we're going to have one there then one then two and then we're going to have another two and then we're going to have three threes three 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 so we've got three threes and the front one we're going to cut out the middle and the back one, we're going to cut out the middle. And we're just going to replace those with upside down slabs. Like that. We're going to come back here. We're going to have two fours. So we're going to one, two, three, four. Go out again. One, two, three, four. And then once we have that, we're going to go out again. And then we're going to have five. So we're going to go two, four, five. Then two upside down slabs. And then we are going to have, uh, once I find out where I am, we're going to have 35 going back. So we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 35. Should be directly over that opening down there. We're going to come to the inside and we're going to add 4 on the inside to make that a 5. So we're going to go 2. And then four. So this should be a five. So we've got two, four, five now. We're going to come to the front here. So where we got these slabs here, behind it, we're going to count back six. So we've got two, four, six. 
and then on the sixth one, so we've got two, four, and then there should be five. On the six, we're just going to come to the inside, and we're going to add two blocks. So we should have five blocks in front of that. So we've got two, four, five in here, and then we've got two here, and then we're going to have three. So we've got three going forward, and then we're going to have five. Two, four, five. Like that. And then once we have that, what we're going to do is in the middle of that three, we're going to put a ladder. And then on our five, the third one, we're going to replace that with a door. Like that. Okay, I'm just going to double check that. Yep. And now we just got all this sort of stuff in, in here to do. So we're going to start off by coming to the front. We're going to skip this block here on the block behind it. We're going to put a cobblestone wall. And then we're going to put four fences on top of it. One, two, three, four. We're going to put a fence in the corner here and here. Just for now. Uh, next we'll do our cobblestone. So where we got this first opening. We're going to put in a cobblestone behind it and then one going back. And then we're going to do that again for the second one. So behind it, and then one going back. So it should be like that. And then where else? Just one over the two opening. So over the two opening, we're going to put one. We're going to put two cobblestones as well, just over this opening here. Well, behind it. We're going to grab our fences. We're just going to put them in the corners, going all the way to there. So it should be like that. And now what we're going to grab, we're going to grab our dark gray carpet. And we're just going to put it over the stone bits of the previous layers. Just, just to cover those up a bit. Okay, now that we have that, what we're going to do next, where do we, what do we do next? How about we do this anchor? So we're gonna, what do we need for this? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 11, 12, 13 in total. So where we've got this first two, we're gonna skip a block and then we're gonna cut this one out. And this one, we're gonna count, we're gonna cut 13 in total back. So we got it, we got one cut out. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Now that we have that, we're going to replace that with stone. Like so. We're going to grab a... Yeah, we're going to grab a staircase because we're going to need one of them. So we're going to put a staircase on the front with a block behind it. Then once we have that, we're going to go down to the back. We're going to put two stone at the back. So we should have a gap of two, four, six, eight, nine. And then I'm just going to count that one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. Okay, so we've got nine anvils over there. So that's how we know we're doing something right. We're going to come to the outside. We're going to put a stone here. And then we're going to put three slabs over the top of that. And then changing the angle with our anvils we're going to place one rotate place one and just pretty much do that going forward like that now that we have that what else can we do we just got this bit these bits in here so what do we will do this piece next so i'm going to grab a counting block don't need anvils anymore Okay, so two, three, yeah. Okay, so behind this, we're going to count back three. One, two, three. Going to put a cobblestone wall on the side. Skip a block, place another one. Grab your slabs, put one in between it, and then add, make that four slabs going back. So I've got one, two, three, four. Go back to your uh, cobblestone wall. You're going to skip this block here, place another one like that. And then, and it turns out I actually went the wrong way. So we're just going to 
grab our slab, put one there, cut this one off, grab our fence, put a fence in there, fence in there, so it should be like that. And then, what do we have on the inside? Okay, so we're going to have a cobblestone wall on this side, skip a block, place another cobblestone wall, place a block between it, then a slab, a block, a slab, then two cobblestone walls there, and two there. Cut out our yellow line, because we won't need that one anymore, so we should have that. And then, I think it has a, yeah, fence between the cobblestone walls. So we're going to have fence there, fence there, like so. And then, what do we have next? We have that little weird cobblestone thing there. So we're going to skip this block. We're going to have two cobblestone walls, two on this side, and then one here, one going back, like that. Okay, what's next? Just got that now. Okay, so we're going to put a, put a yellow block here, and then two cobblestone blocks. Make that a 2 by 3 going back, like so. Cut out a yellow block. Three cobblestone walls going down the side. And then two on top of there, two on top of there, two stone slabs in between them. Like that. I'm just going to double check that. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, now that we have all that, that's this whole front piece done here. So what you're going to do now is everything we just built, you're going to copy to the other side and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so this is what we should have now. <clears throat> so the next couple of layers are pretty, like next two layers are pretty much the same. So what we're going to start off by doing is we're going to come down to where we've got this line here. From here, we're going to go back two. So we're going one, two. And then we're going to place a staircase. So we've got two blocks, a staircase, a block, and then a staircase. And then 25 going back. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 25. We're going to add 4 in here. So that's, I'm running through that again. That's two blocks here, a staircase, block, staircase, 25, and then 4. On here, we're going to place two there, three here, two here, two here to the middle. We're going to bring our ladder up by one. And then we're going to put a staircase there. Now that we've done that, what we're going to do from this layer here, we're going to place a block here. This is going to go back 30. So straight up, that will run back all the way to the end. So it's 30 to there. And then going in here and then on the front we got two and then a three and then a five two four five to the middle at the back what we're going to do is we're going to grab our dark gray and we're going to head to this corner we're going to go forward by ten so we're going to two four six eight ten we're going to run this to the middle, so just to the middle for now. And then at the back here, we're going to run this to the middle. And then we're just going to pretty much connect those. Fill this in. Just fill all of this in, head in back. And once we have that filled in, we're going to pretty much what we just did with those two layers, we're going to copy them to the other side. And then we'll get on, actually this front window by the way, this staircase actually is facing the other way. So this is a big, this is like pretty much the equivalent of two blocks gap between those two small gaps. So you just got this one facing forward, this one facing backwards. And then once you got that, you're gonna copy that, you're gonna copy those two to the other side. Don't forget to build your ladder up again. And once you got that, we'll just yeah, 
just copy that to the other side and we'll continue on. Okay, so what we're going to do on this layer, we're going to come down to the front here. We are going to go back 20 blocks. So we're going to go 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Should be in line with this dark gray here. This last part of the run there. And then going in, including that one, we're going to go 9. So we've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. We're going to go diagonal, like diagonal inwards. And we're going to do a 3 by 3. And this 3x3 three three should be right in the center. 1, 2, 2, 4, 5. 4, 5. 2, 4, 6. Is that actually 6 on that side? 2, 4, 6. 2, 4, 2, 4, 6. Oh, I didn't realize those are actually 6, not 5. Okay, so what we're also going to do is... These, these back runs here on both sides, they're going to actually be 6 going up. So we've got 2, 4, 6. So we should have 6 iron bars going across. 2, 4, 6. Same as this side. 2, 4, 6. Make sure that that 3x3 three three is center from the center line, which it is. And then on the left-hand side, we're going to run our railings in, like so. We're going to build the wall up for the across to the other side just for here and then what we're going to do at the front we'll do the front bit first so we're going to put two in here three here five here to the center grab your ladder put your ladder in like so then grab your dark ray and you're going to go back six from this corner here you're going to go two four six like so we're going to run this to the center, to just to the center for now, and we're just going to fill that in. Like so, just fill all of this in, and once we've filled it in, we'll just do a bit of detail. We'll do some of the stuff on the back here. Well, we'll do most of the stuff on the back here. So we're going to start up by cutting out for our doors. So we're going to skip two on this side and then cut out for a door. Put it in. So just on the left hand side we're going to skip two blocks. Cut the third one out for a door. On the right hand side we're going to skip two and then skip four. So on the right hand side we're going to skip two. Cut out for a door. Skip four. Cut out for a door and there should be one. On this side, you're going to put one iron bar here. And then on the corner, you aren't going to have any wrapping around. But what you're going to do from this from this spot here on the right-hand side is you're just going to put in a plus in front of it, like so. On the, I'm going to have to check this on the left-hand side. We're going to skip two and then two, four, five. Two and a five by three. Okay, so on the left hand side, from the second one, we're going to skip two. We're going to place five going across, like so. Make that a five by three. Skip a block, another five by three. And then we're going to double those up. And then we're going to do 5x3 with our cobblestone slabs on top. Like so. And then, where did I have those tripwire hooks? I'm going to skip one from that side. Okay. So we're going to skip this one, place two. Like that. We don't need our tripwire hooks or our ladders right now. What we will need uh, 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 is our cobblestone, our black carpet, and we'll get that out of the way. So in the center line, we've got one here. We're just going to go diagonal one, place one there, one there, like so. Make those four. And then the right-hand side, this is going to have an extra three connected into it. I'm just going to double-check that. 
Okay, so it should be like that. And then we're going to cover that with black carpet. Like so. We're going to grab our stone. We'll get this small little crane done next. We're going to put two blocks on top. And then we're going to put a slab on the bottom hitbox. On the head towards the back. And then head towards the front. We're going to have five slabs going diagonal up. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, and five. Like that. Put a fence underneath them. Or an iron bar or an end rod. Whatever you want to use for your cranes sort of like table. Then once we have that, that's that crane done. Okay, we'll get our rib done next. So I'm just going to grab what I need from here. Okay, where do I start this? Alright, I'll start there. So we're going to skip two. Okay, so where we've got this iron bar, we're going to skip two blocks here. We're going to put a slab, skip a block, skip a, skip a blob, skip a block, and then place another one. And then going back, we're going to skip two, place another one, and then like so. So we should have a gap or two there, gap or two there. Then on this one, we're just going to put in a slab up here. Go one forward, two back, and then one here. So we should have five in total. I'm going to put a block in front, blocks on the side. Those blocks are going to go back five. So I'm going to go two, four. Five, two, four, five. So it should be like that so far. I'm going to put a block back here and a hopper connecting to it. Three blocks across there. One in the back corner, one in that corner. Grab your slabs. Three slabs in here to make a block and a slab. Grab your fences. Two here, two here. Three connecting them. And then grab your carpet and just put one and then a three in there. Just for your rib. Okay, we'll get rid of what we don't need here. I'm going to grab stone, stairs, and a pressure plate. So we're going to go up, what, two, four, and then two, three. Okay. So this... 3x3 three three is going to go up to a height of 4. So we got 1, 2, 3, and 4. Like so. Now we're going to put two blocks there. We're going to wrap around them with stairs. Like so. And then we're going to do a, a 2 going back. And then another two on top, one here, staircase behind it, pressure plate on top, like so. And once we've done that, what we did down here, you're going to just copy that to the other side, and we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to come down to this corner. We're going to go back seven with our iron bars. We're going to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then behind it, we are going to go 13 back. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. We're going to head back up here. We're going to skip this first block and we're going to put five buttons going back. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Like so. And that was just five, yeah? Yeah, it was five. So there's five buttons going back. Going to put a block in there. And then we're going to head back to this iron bar. And right next to it, on the block next to it, we're going to run this across to the other side. Remember, it should stop shy of that end because both sides are identical with this bit here. So now that we have that, the only bit that's different is this front, the front doors and windows, pretty much. So on this side, we're going to skip two, cut out for a door, like so. On the other side, we're going to skip two, four, five. We're going to skip five. We're going to go two, four, five. 
on the six, we're going to cut out the six for a door. We're going to grab our iron bars, head to the center here, wrap them around, skip the one with the ladder, and just continue wrapping it in. Grab your dark gray wool, put it right there. And once you got that, we're going to head to the back. So both the sides on the back are a bit different, so I'm just going to put two blocks in there for that side because to make that identical to the other side. I just got to see where these windows are. Okay, so they're pretty straightforward. So on this side, we're going to place a block, skip a block, place a block, skip a block, place two blocks like that. So I've got one, 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 two. And those gaps are just going to be windows. On this side, we're going to place a block in here. So place one here, skip a block, place two. And then make that a window. And then just fill in behind here with three. Okay, now that we have that, there's a few things on the front we can do. So we're going to need cobblestone wall, anvils, an orange block, black carpet, and we're going to need a counting block. Okay, so to start this off, we've got our cobblestone wall. So what we're going to do is we're going to head to this corner, go diagonal one, and place a cobblestone wall, like so. Once you got that, we're going to skip three. So we're going to go to our counting block. We're going to go one, two, three. And then we're just going to have two anvils next to it, one going back. Cut those out. And now for this front bit, the only bit that's different is the orange box. So we're going to go to our orange. We're going to skip this center block here. We're going to add three. And then going to the uh, right-hand side of the ship, we're just going to place another three like that. And then a two-by-three carpet on top, like so. Okay, what we can do next is we're going to come to the front here. We're going to grab our, um, our dark ray. We're going to place, well, not our dark ray, we're going to grab our stone. We're going to place two right there. We're going to go to our, I'm just going to clear some of this out. We're going to grab our stairs. We're going to place two stairs behind it, like so. So we've got two blocks, two stairs. And then we've got four blocks, two, four. And then we're going to have three slabs, one, two, three. And then two blocks. So we've got two blocks, two stairs, four blocks, three slabs, two blocks. And then our we're going to do a run across to the middle, just for now, just to there. And then pretty much the other side will have that going up. And you're just going to pretty much what we don't have from the previous layer. So the cobblestone wall and the anvils, you're just going to wrap those. You're just going to copy those to the other side. So I'm just going to do it with the railings. So we should have that. And then we're going to need this. Should be a gap of three. Well, this side would be two. One, two. So it should be in line with that door, if I've got that correct. Yep. And then our cobblestone wall for this side. So just bear with me one second. So we should have that on the front. And then down here, we're just going to have a line going into there, pretty much, is what we should have. Okay, so we'll get this front bit done. What we're going to do is we're going to place two here. And then I'm just going to have to check. Okay, we're going to have three windows. So we're going to place a block, skip a block, place a block, skip one, place, skip one, place. So we should have three windows and then three blocks in there. So all we just need is three windows. So we've got four blocks there, block there, block there, block there. Windows between those gaps. For this side, we're going to place a block, skip a block, place a block. Skip this block, place a block. 
and then we should have two windows there. We're going to copy what we did on that side to this side and then fill in behind those openings with black with a black block. And once you've done that, we'll continue on. Okay, so this is what you should have now. What we're going to do next is we're going to come to the front here. We're going to grab our stone block. We're just going to run this line into the middle. So we should just bring that into the middle for now. We're going to come back to the side. We're going to run this back. And then we're going to run it into the middle from here. Like so. So it should just connect straight to the middle. And then what we're going to do next is we're going to come back to the front. We're going to build that up again. Then we're going to wrap this one around. Pretty much just build up the previous layer again, like so. We're going to grab our dark gray. We're going to head down to the previous layer and we're just going to fill in just beneath here. Like so. And we're just going to fill that into the middle. Like so, and then once we've filled the entire thing in, we'll go from there. So we're just going to fill this part in, and once we've done it, we're almost there. Okay, so this is what we should have now. What we're going to do next is we're going to head to this corner here. We're going to put in a white skull there. We're going to grab our stairs. We're going to skip two blocks, and then we're going to place an upside down one. So we should have a gap of two and then an upside down, and just run that to the middle. Just got to double check that's a gap of two. Yep. And then, and then, and then, and then, we're going to come back here. We're going to skip this one, and we're going to cut out inside there. Like so. And then from this block here, we're going to go back 11. So we've got one, two, three. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Oh, 12 in total. Sorry, it's 11 from the block behind it. So you should have just the one, one block opening behind here. We're going to run this to the center, like that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to come back to the back corner here. We're going to skip this block, cut out a door. And then on the next block, we're going to place a cobblestone wall. Then we're going to skip two blocks, place another cobblestone wall. Just skip two. On the third, we're going to cut out a door. So we should have that. And once you have that, you're going to copy that to the other side. And we'll get on to the next layer. Alright, so the next two layers are pretty straightforward. So what we're going to do is we're going to start off in this corner here. We're going to place a block there. Behind it, we're going to place two glass blocks. And then one stone behind that. On the front, we're going to place a glass block. And then a cobblestone wall, glass block, cobblestone wall, glass block, cobblestone wall. And then a glass block in the middle. We're going to head back here. We're going to grab our stone. We're going to put two, four, six in there. And then we're going to run this one to the middle. And then what we're going to do is we're going to build up these two cobblestone walls to a height of two. And then put two tripwire hooks between them. And then you're going to copy that to the other side. And once you've done that, we're going to head to the middle here. Actually, we'll head to the side here. We're just going to run this across to the middle, like so. And then on the back, we're just going to wrap this, we're just going to run this back and wrap it around to the middle, like so. We're going to build up our two cobblestone walls. And then we're going to grab our dark gray, and we're just going to fill in this negative space here. Like so. Okay, once we've got that, 
we just got one more thing we want to do for this layer. And it'll just save us just the trouble a little bit later. We're going to grab our iron bars. And we're just going to go to the middle. And we're going to wrap them around that back corner. All the way around to there. And then you, what you're going to do now is you're just going to copy that to the other side. And we'll get on to this last bit for this section. So I'll leave you to it. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm going to have to do a bit of back and forth here just to get the count on things. But what we're going to start off by doing is down where we have this piece at the back, we're going to chuck a ladder on that front side of it. Forgot to add that in on the previous one. Well, when we built it, but it's there now. So it's the thought that counts. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to put a block right here at the back in the center. We're going to put a block to the side of it. So to make that a three. And then it's going to be a three by five going forward. So we're going to go two, four, five, and then wrap that around. So you should have a three by five. And then what you're going to do is you're just going to wrap around the outside of it with your stairs, like so. Grab your block, three blocks in here. And then on this front block, you're going to go up by three. The one behind it, you're going to go up by six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then you're going to put a block on the back of it for now. And you're going to go up by four with that. So one, two, three, four. Just for now. So that's, we've just started laying out for the mast. What we're going to do first is we're just going to do the surrounding bits. So down here, we're going to put a iron bar. And then two cobblestone blocks. Two iron bars afterwards. I'm going to do that on the other side as well. And then what we're going to do is we're going to grab our cobblestone wall. We're going to come down to the corner. We're going to skip the first block, place it on the second. Do that on both sides. And I just need to figure out what these are at a height of. They are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. They are 10 in height. Okay, what we're going to do is where we've got this cobblestone wall, I'm going to come to the block on the inside and then go back one. I'm going to do that on this side as well. So it should be in line with this first line of this uh, piece that sticks up. We're going to grab our iron bars. We're going to place them on top and we're going to go up 10. So I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Here as well. 1, 2, 3, 4. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's two done. Got two more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And one more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Like that. And that's all four of those done. So we don't need to do any more of them. But I am going to need a counting block. So I don't need a cobblestone wall anymore. A uh, cobblestone block, I meant. So we just got a few things to do. Okay, so what we're going to start off by doing is we're going to come to the center. We're going to run our counting, block, counting blocks forward to the front bit there. We're going to skip a, yeah, skip a block. And then we're going to add two going this way two going this way like that then we're going to put a block on each on each end like so and then bring those blocks to a height of two then a cobblestone wall on each one and then a stair facing forward on top like so all right so we don't need Actually, we'll keep our counting blocks in. We don't need these two and these two. But we will need it for this stuff. So we're going to go... Uh, that'll be on the second one. So we're going to skip the first one. Cut out the second one. Put in a cobblestone wall. Then skip a block to the uh, left-hand side. And then put an iron bar. That's going to go to a height of four. So I've got one, 
two, three, four. Okay, now that we've got that, what else do we need? We've got another cobblestone wall in front of that, and then we've got these two. Okay. So what we're going to do behind this cobblestone wall, we're going to place two blocks that way. We're going to cut this one out. We're going to cut these out. We're going to grab our cobblestone wall. We're going to skip this block, place one here. And then we're going to place one here. Actually, I don't think that's there. So we're just going to leave that as it is for now. Let's see what I did here. Okay. We've got four behind it. All right, so we're going to grab our iron bars. We're going to go behind this two. We're going to go one, two, three, four, like that. And then be, this will be two blocks from there, so it'll be like that if you need that. But we're just going to put in a stone block here. Bring that to a height of two. Actually, is that a two or a three? Uh, one, two, I think that might be two. Yeah, it's two. Okay, so to bring that to a height of two, we're going to put a staircase on top of it, and then a staircase going forward. We're going to cut out the counting blocks, which are the yellow blocks, and then we're going to grab ladders. We're going to put that in on the front there. We're going to grab our cobblestone wall, because we just got two cobblestone walls to put down. One there, one there. Okay, so they're pretty straightforward. So we're going to have one right next to this, and then one right, is that right? I need to check that. Oh, that's actually a block over. I thought it was in line. Okay, so they're in the right spot. So this one's in the right spot. This thing just needs to move over by a block. So we're just going to move this over by one. Then we're going to move the cobblestone wall over by one. And then the iron bars are just going to be moved over by one towards the center. So it'll be like that. So we've got cobblestone wall there, one there. And then that's, there's your bird's eye view of if you need it. Okay, now that we have that, all we have left is the mast itself. So I'm going to figure out how we're going to do this. So what we're going to do first, go three. Okay, so we'll go to the top three here. So we've got three here. We're going to add two on the side, two on the side going forward, and then two in the center like that. I'm going to put a cobblestone wall on top of this one, two slabs in the middle, two fences there, two fences there, then three white slabs on top of that cobblestone wall. This can go any way. This thing just spins. So you can have it straight, or you can have it angled, like that. Okay, we got that one. Next, we're just going to put in a slab here, and a slab here. Now that we've got that out of the way, we're going to come up to up here. We're just going to place two slabs going forward from here, and then two on the side, two on this side as well. So we should have it like that. Then I just need to check anything else. Nope. That's the block up, and it goes out by four. Okay. So this block here, we're just going to bring four slabs out to each side. And then on the third one going out, we're just going to add a black skull on both sides, like so. And once we have that, we just got this area to do. So what we're going to do first, we're going to put a staircase there at the top. And then on the block below on the back, we're going to place one and then a block on top. So it should have that. And then we're going to put a slab on the front, two slabs on the side, two slabs on this side. Two fences on those slabs. A cobblestone wall. Uh, sorry, no, a block first, and then a cobblestone wall. And then three slabs on top of that cobblestone wall, like that. 
Next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab our cobblestone wall. We're going to go to here. We're going to go up three, one, two, three, and then a block. Oh no, a fence. Then a cobblestone wall. So we should have three cobblestone walls, a fence, a cobblestone wall, a fence, and then another cobblestone wall. And that finishes off this bridge section. So hopefully the next section is a bit easier. It looks a bit easier than that section. So yeah, let's just continue on since we got we got through that. Give yourself a pat on the back and let's move on. Okay, so what we're gonna do now, so this first couple layers are gonna be a little bit complicated just because of the amount of stuff on them. So we're gonna come down to here first. We're gonna start by placing a block and then a cobblestone wall and then two white blocks, polished diorite or iron, blo uh, iron block, depending on your texture pack, just to give them like a bit of texture, just for your saltwater activated life rafts. Then you're gonna put another cobblestone wall, another two white blocks, and then another cobblestone wall, so it should be like that. I'm gonna grab your buttons, put them on the sides, put your pressure plates on top, and then you're gonna put two cobblestone walls behind them, like so. You're gonna go back to your stone block. You're gonna go back 10, two, four, six, eight, 10. You're gonna go to your iron bar. You're gonna go one here. And then you're gonna do this run along here on the top of these slabs, like so. And then you're gonna put it in a block behind it. And then you're gonna go cobblestone wall, two white blocks, cobblestone wall, two white blocks, Cobblestone, oh, that's not cobblestone wall. Cobblestone wall, two white blocks, and then a wall, like so. So you should have three sets of two. And then you're going to put your buttons on them, your pressure plates on top, your walls behind them, like so. And then you're going to go back to your stone block, and you're going to go five, two, four, five. And then you're going to go wall, two white blocks, wall, two white blocks, and then a wall. And then you're going to put your two walls behind them, your pressure plates on top, your buttons on the side. And that's the first run there. What we're going to do next is we're going to come to where we got this. I just need to check. It's going to be two, four. It'll be on the fifth on the inside. So it'll be two, four on the fifth. So yeah, from here. We're going to go back 14. So we're going to go two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14. We're going to grab a iron door. We're going to place it in. So we've got 14, a door. And then we're going to have six, two, four, six, and then a door. So we've got 14, door, six, door. And then we're going to have 13, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13, and then a door. And then we're going to go 13 again, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 13. And it should be directly in line with that cobblestone wall. Okay, now that we have that, what we're going to do, this back wall here, we're just going to build this up to a height of three for now. Just gonna build those up. Build these up. And then build this one up as well. Then you're just gonna put in a block above those doors. So there should be three doors in total. Okay, now comes the part where I gotta, actually not yet, I can still do a few more things if without it first. All right, so I'm gonna clear out a block. I'm gonna keep a block, a cobblestone wall. I'm gonna need tripwire hooks. I'm gonna need a counting block. I'll grab what I need from here. Cobblestone, black carpet, stone stairs, dark gray stairs, iron bars for now. Okay, so we're going to come to the front here. We're going to skip two blocks. 
Oh, is it two? I don't know. We're going to skip one, and then we're going to place one Dark Race there. Oh, no. But, you know, we're going to skip two, place a Dark Race there, then place another one going up. So we're just going to pretty much build our stairs sort of going up to that deck up there. I'm going to put in an upside down staircase there, an upside down staircase there, like that. Grab your iron bars. You're going to place one here, one here, and then one up here, just for now. Okay, we're going to skip a block here. So we're going to skip this block. We're going to do a 2 by 3 of our cobblestone. I'm going to bring that to a height of 2 like so, and then just cover that with black carpet, like so. We're going to grab our stone block, we're going to put three going up here. We're going to cut this carpet off, put another one there, like so. And then we're just going to put on a two by two on top of it, like that. Once we have that, uh, I'm just looking across at the moment to see what I'm going to do. We're going to grab our cobblestone wall. We're going to build three up here. In the middle, we're going to chuck two tripwire hooks. And then three cobblestone wall going up. Two tripwire hooks. Three cobblestone wall going up. And it should look like that. We're going to go to this door here. We're going to skip this block. And then we're going to place three cobblestone wall going up. Then we're going to head to this door, we're going to skip one, place three going up, like that. So we should have a gap of one here, gap of two here, gap of two here, two, two. <clears throat> okay, now that we have that, I'm going to have to actually see the distance between this one, two between there. Okay, yeah, no, it's straight, pretty straightforward at the moment. Okay, so from this side of the door, we're going to skip two and then a line of cobblestone more going up cut them out grab our trip by hooks so we're going to place two go back to our cobblestone wall build three up skip one three up then we're going to head to this door we're going to have three up going here and then two going back so we should have that so far what we're going to do next is we're going to grab our block we're going to have, I'm going to need to count that. I think it's four. Yeah, we're going to have four going back. So from down here, we're going to have four going back. One, two, three, four. Build that to a height of three. Two by two at the front of it. So it'll be like so. And then behind it, we're going to have two tripwire hooks. Three cobblestone wall going up. Two tripwire hooks. Three cobblestone wall going up like that we're almost there so we're just going to clear out our inventory we're going to grab buttons for a start so we're going to need those so pretty much right next to this back door so the last door we're going to go four buttons going forward so one two three four like so and then we just got a few things on the deck to do so we're going to need cobblestone wall we're going to need Cobblestone, pressure plates, stone, and that's about it for now. Okay, so I'm going to need to do a bit of back and forth here. So where we put those buttons, on the wall in front of it, we're going to place a block here. And then we're going to go diagonal back, and we're going to have three. Is it three or four? No, it's four. We're going to have four going back. So it'll be like that. Okay, we're going to skip two blocks here. We're going to place a cobblestone wall on the third. And that's going to go back. That's going to go back four. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. Like so. Actually, it's going to go back five. So it'll be like that. There's a bird's eye view if you need that. It should be directly in line with this run here. Okay, so where we got this block here... We're going to have some cobblestone wall, uh, some cobblestone blocks. We're going to skip a block, place one. That's going to go forward by three. And then have one going outwards, like so. We're then going to go to this block here, skip a block, place two going that way. And then 
three connecting into it like that. Grab your pressure plates, chuck them on top of there. Grab your dark grey carpet, and you're just going to chuck it over these blocks in there just to give that grey look. I'm going to get rid of that because we don't need that anymore. Okay, where well we got this door, we're going to come to the outer wall. We're going to go. We're going to skip one, and then we're going to place two there for now, and that's going to go forward four in total. So be like that. So it should be a gap of two from here, and then four going forward. We're going to skip this block here and add three cobblestone wall. And now that we have that, that's one side complete. So what we're going to do next is you're just going to copy that to the other side and then fill in from here all the way to here with dark gray wool, pretty much. Well, you, your deck color, really. And once you've done that, we can continue on. Okay, so what we're going to build now is we're going to build this little centerpiece here. So we're going to start off by coming down here, including this iron bar, we should have four. So two, four. So we've got four iron bars in there. And then we are going to have 11 from here. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. And then we're going to have one stone block behind it, and then one in heading towards the middle one right next to it so we have 11 iron bars and then one one we're going to come to the outside here on top of this cobblestone wall we are going to go back 11 so 2 4 6 8 10 11 and then in front of it from over here we're going to have seven going across 2 4 6 7 and then we'll have two well two ones i meant to say and then our 11. And then we're going to have 1, 1, 7, 1, 1. So we'll pretty much have that on top, pretty much. So we've, we've got our run of 11, and then we've got our two ones, and then 11 going that way, and then 7 going across. What we're going to do is so we're just going to build half for now. So we're just going to pretty much build that up by 2. Like so, build it up by two. So now that we have that, we're going to come to the side, we're going to skip a block, and then we're going to put down three buttons going forward. And then from the front, we're going to skip a block, three buttons going back. Now it's three. Oh, okay, that's not actually meant to be 11, it's actually meant to be nine. So we're going to, we're just going to bring that forward. I thought that looked a bit, a bit long. But no, yeah, no, it's it's nine by seven. So it's one, one, seven. So we got seven going across, nine going back. Let's try that again with the buttons. So we have one, two, three. Skip a block, one, two, three. And there should be a gap of one between it. So on each side of the buttons on the on the on the sides, we're just gonna have gaps of one pretty much. Okay. Now that, we, now that we've done that, what we're going to do next is these two ones are going to be just two glass blocks there. Uh, we're going to have to build this one up to a height of two. Then we're going to have one glass block there, uh, two glass blocks there, I meant. Then we're going to have stone there, stone there, and we're just going to go glass, skip a block, glass, skip, glass, skip, and then just fill in the gaps with cobblestone wall like that. Grab our stone again, one there, one in the back, and we're just going to pretty much do the same thing. Go to glass, skip a block, glass, cobble, skip down wall in between. And then we're going to grab our slabs, and I don't actually have slabs. We're going to need uh, slabs. Okay, so we're going to add, what, we're going to add four on this first run. Go one, two, three, four. Same with the back. One, two, three, four. Double those up. So there will be two by fours. 
like that. And then we'll do our run down across the top here. Like that, that should be nine. And then that's going to be a nine by two. So we're going to double that up. Like so. And then we're just going to have one here. One here. So it should be like that. So the nine by two, and then we'll have a five by two, isn't it? Four by two, sorry. And then just one connecting them. Okay, next thing we're going to do is we're going to just going to add a slab here, a slab here, slab here, slab here. So it looks like that. And then we're just going to pretty much build them up. So this will be three, one, two, four, six, seven. So it'll be a three, one, and a seven. And then a one and a three, like so. And we're just going to pretty much fill that in now. Okay. We're going to put a block there, block there, and then we're going to find the center. It should be there. And then we're just going to pretty much line them up so they mark out where the center is. So we just have a block there for now. What we're going to do is we're going to grab our white slabs, then our white block. We're just going to pretty much put a white block there, white block there, white block there to make a plus. Cut out that one. Then I'm going to make a 2 by 3 on top. And then the other half of the plus. So it'll be like that, pretty much. And then we just put a slab there, slab there, upside down one, upside down one. Like that. And that is that half done. So is there any doors on that? No, there isn't. I haven't missed anything. Nope. Okay, uh, we'll finish marking out these railings. So we're going to grab our iron bars again. We're going to pretty much run this one back. Connect in there. This one wraps around and then runs back. We can cut that out, replace that with a dark gray wool, a dark gray block, or our deck color. Hmm. I just... Did I? Yep. I did screw that up. Sorry, I'm just checking some of mine. Okay, yeah, no. Ah, uh, I see how I see why I've how I managed to screw that up. It's actually when I originally built that. So what we're meant to have is cut this one off this side and then build that up. It should be the exact same as that side, pretty much. So it's pretty much a dark red wall. So it's pretty much this side and that side are pretty much identical. They're just flipped. So don't think it's anything wrong with the tutorial. It's just how I originally built it. I made a mistake and actually rotated it 180 instead of flipping it is when I originally built it. So yeah, just ignore that. Anywho, let's get back into this. So yeah, now that we've got this sort of railing done, we just got some small bits of detail to do, and then we're on to the, I don't know what to call them, the damn bits maybe, I don't know. Okay, so we're going to need cobblestone, slab, cobblestone wall, fences, what else, uh, black carpet. Alright, so we'll start with the front. Okay, so directly in the center. We're going to go four black fences going forward. And then next to it, we're going to have four cobblestone walls going forward. We're going to have a cobblestone wall in the first one. Skip a block, cobblestone wall. Put carpet between them, like so. And is there anything else on that? Yes. We're going to have four slabs running forward from there. That's heading towards the front of the ship. Now that we have that... Where we got this cobblestone wall here, the second one, right behind it, we're going to put down a cobblestone wall, one behind it, one in front, like that. Okay, what else? Um, I'm going to need a counting block for this. 
Okay. So at the front of that, we're going to place our two counting blocks. And then we're going to have three cobblestone wall going forward. I'm going to double check that. Oh no, sorry, it's three blocks going forward. So cut that off. Three blocks going forward. Cut out our counting block. And then what's on them? I'm going to need pressure plates. Okay, at the back we're going to have two pressure plates, at the front a cobblestone wall, and then we're going to come to the front, two counting blocks there, three cobblestone blocks going forward, and we're going to do the same thing. So cobblestone wall at the front, pressure plates at the back, and it should look like that so far. Okay, last but not least, where we got the front of this, we're going to put down a counting block and then we're going to put a cobblestone wall behind it. We're going to make that go forward by three. And now that we have that, you can copy that to the other side. And then once you've done that, we'll get onto the back bit down here. So what are we going to do? We're going to skip a block. Okay, so that's pretty straightforward. Okay, so we're going to come here, we're going to skip this one, we're going to place our canny block there, behind it, three cobblestone walls, skip block going in, three cobblestone walls, like so. Now that we've got that, uh, what's next? We'll do the center line piece first, so we're going to go two, four, we're going to four, three, one, three. So, yeah, pretty straightforward. So we're going to go to the center, we're going to go one, two, three, four, three cobblestone wall, one, three cobblestone wall, like that. So four counting blocks, th uh, three cobblestone wall, one counting block, three cobblestone wall. Get rid of our yellow, because we don't need that. And then, what do we need for this? It's going to be four by twos, pretty straightforward. So at the end of this first three, we're going to have a, we're going to have a gap, and then we have a two by four going back, like so. On the front, we're going to have two slabs, and then we're going to have on the, on the out outer side of the ship, we're going to have three slabs running back, and then three uh, cobblestone blocks between them. Going to grab our cobblestone wall, one there, skip a block, one there. Like so, get rid of our counting block. And then once we've got that, uh, we just got this back bit to do. So we're going to need a gap of three, and the threes. Okay. So directly behind that, we're going to leave a gap of three, and then we're going to have three cobblestone uh, blocks. On the outside, we're going to have three fences. On the inside, we're going to have three walls. And then on top, we're just going to have three stone slabs. Like so. Now that you have that, copy that to the other side. And then we'll just get onto these uh, damn bit things, whatever they're called. So, let's get to them. Okay, so let's get onto the damn bits things. <laughs> What we're going to do is we're going to come down to where we got these two squares and we're going to grab our stone. We're going to go to one. We're just going to build this up to a height of 10. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's 10 blocks high there, not including that bottom one. So sitting on top of that is 10 high. And now we're going to build that, the rest of it up, pretty much. So if we include the one that was pretty much this is built on top of, it'll be including this, it'll be 11 high, but without it, just the, the rest of these up from here will be 10. Then we're going to have to build both of them up. So we're just going to build this all the way up to a height of here, yeah, oh, 11 total. That'd be 11 high in total. And once we have that, we're just going to run a line across. We're just going to make that two 
well, this field make that two by whatever that is. And then just fill in behind it. Okay, now that we have that, we're going to go to the left hand side, left hand side of the ship, and we're just going to grab our buttons, and just above the iron bars, we're just going to run those up. And then on the opposite side, we're going to cut out this iron bar, and that shouldn't be stone, but it's going to pretty much uh, grab our ladders, run that up, like so. Then what we're going to do is we're going to cut off two here, we're going to put two stone, grab our iron bars, wrap them around, cut that one out, make that dark grey, like that, just for that ladder. And now that we have that, we're going to go underneath. So we've got the front of the ships there. On the outer block, we're just going to run some upside down slabs across. And then we're going to put one in the center, like so. So it should be like that. And then what you're going to do now is you're going to take this and you're going to flip it 180 degrees and you're going to build it on top of that one. So pretty much uh, the slabs on here, on the back one, are on the opposite side. So this one facing inwards and that one's facing inwards. And then this long run across is facing towards the back. And on the backhand side, you'll have your buttons on one side and your ladders on the other side, pretty much going up like that. And that will make things just a bit easier when you're building the second one up. So you'll be like, oh, okay, so it's flipped around this way. Here's one. Okay, so how did I do this? So I've got, what we're going to do now is we're going to put one cobblestone slab there. We're going to put three across there on top of it with our block. And I'm going to have to do a bit of back and forth here. And two. Okay, then we're going to have two slabs connecting that. And then on top of those slabs, we're going to have two blocks going like that. So we've got three blocks here, two blocks here, two blocks on the outside. So it'll be three and then four in total. And then one slab here. And then I'm going to have to come back over here and have another look. We've got three in there and two. Okay, so we're going to have three slabs in here, we're going to skip two, place two, then two blocks, like so. So we'll have three blocks here, three slabs on top, one underneath it in the center, and then connecting to those blocks, we're going to have two slabs, two upside down ones, and then four uh, blocks on top of that going out, one slab connecting into that, on top of those two is two more slabs connected by two blocks, and then two more slabs like so. So it'll make this sort of pattern. And then you're just going to do that on the other side as well. So you're going to go two, and then four, then a one. You're going to head back up here, skip two, two, then two blocks, two slabs like so. So it'll make that sort of pattern going across. Then you're going to grab your buttons and you're just going to put one in the middle. Two here. Actually, what is it? Two. One, two, and then two up there. Yeah. Then two up here. I'm going to do that on this side as well. Two here. Two here. Then we're going to grab our iron bars. We're just going to put two iron bars there. And then skip this block here, run these across, and then wrap them in. Grab your carpet, run it across here, one there, like so. And in the center, we're going to cut out the carpet, replace it with a cobblestone wall. And then on top of that, we are going to have eight, eight iron bars going up. So we're going to have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight like so and then we 
just got this to do. So we're going to actually also have one iron bar there, one iron bar here. Okay, so I'm going to clear this out and just grab what I need. So I'm just going to need a cobblestone wall. I'm going to also grab coal, just in case you don't have black cobblestone wall, you can do this with coal. So I'll go four, two, and then three. So what we're going to do is under here, we're going to go down by four. So we're going to one, two, three, four. And then I put one here underneath that. We're going to go two, one, two. So we've got four, and then we've got two down here. And I'm just going to double check it right here. And then down here, we're going to have three. We've got three here. So we've got four, two, three. We're going to add three on top of this. One, two, three. And then we're going to go one, two, three, four there, like that. Or if you're doing this with with coal, since you don't have that block, if you don't, you're going to go one, two, three, four. So you're going to have four. And then you're going to have your two. You're going to have three, like so. You're going to add three on top. And then three in here. Well, four in there, I should say. So be like that, pretty much. So either all works. It just depends on what you prefer. I prefer the cobblestone wall, the black cobblestone wall. It just seems to work a lot better for me. But that's pretty much what you're going to do. Okay, so now that we've built that, what we're going to do now is everything we just built, flip 180 on this one, and it should look like this on heading towards the back. So that's your back and the ship down there, and it should look like this on the inside. So once you've done that, that's this middle section done with the pumps, with the oil uh, pump stuff, whatever it is. And one last thing, what you want to do is you want to grab your light gray carpet. And you're just going to put them over these two glass here. Just wrap them around there. i got to fix those buttons as well. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, sorry about that. Um, yeah. Now, one thing you can also do is on the inside, you can just run buns down here as well. And on the inside here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Like that on the inside, just for some extra detail. And once you've done that, we'll get on to this final hanger section. So, let's get to that. Okay, we're almost there. What we're going to start off by doing is we're going to come down to the end here when we're going to go one block and then we're going to have five iron bars one two three four five and then we're going to have two blocks so we've got one block five iron bars two blocks and then we're going to have two diorite one cobblestone wall two diorite one cobble one cobblestone wall two diorite one cobblestone wall, two diorites. So we should have four diorite, uh, four sets of two diorites. We're gonna add our buns to the side, our trapdoors, our not trapdoors, our slabs to the top, like so. And then we're gonna have one, and then an iron bar, one, two iron bars, and then one, like so. We're going to go to the, uh, I need to quick check something. We're going to have a gap of three. It's going to be on the safe side. So we're going to have a gap of three. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so what we're going to do is behind this cobblestone wall, we're going to have our block here. So we have a gap of three here. And this is this block is going to go back, uh, it's going to go two. We're going to have two blocks there. And then we're going to have a door. And then we're going to have 24 blocks going back. So we're going to 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. Like so. So it should pass by 2, pretty much. So I'm going to double check on this one. Should pass by on 2. Yep. What we're going to do next is we're just going to finish off this uh, flight deck here. So pretty much in this after this 7 here. We're going to have one redstone torch here, like so. And then one in this corner, 
we, we don't need our redstone torch anymore until we do the other side. We're going to grab our iron trapdoors. We're going to start from the middle. I'm just going to wrap around here, pretty much. Just wrap this around. All the way to the end of this white here. Okay, and then we're just going to pretty much come past it and stop just short of that block, like so. Don't need our iron trapdoor anymore. Our flight deck is pretty much complete. Uh, I'm just going to grab the upside down stair there. So what we're going to do next, at the end of this run, we're going to put in a staircase. And then behind it, we're going to put an upside down staircase. And then I'm going to grab a... We don't need those for now. I'm going to grab a counting block because there is a few cobblestone walls underneath. We don't need those either. So we're going to leave a gap of two and then a gap of two, four, five. Gap of two and a gap of five. So behind the stairs, we're going to leave a gap of two, cobblestone wall, gap of five, two, four, five, uh, five, and then a cobblestone wall. Like so. And then for the front ones, <clears throat> Front one, I should say. Gap of five, pretty much from that door. So where have we got that door that we put down? We're going to go two, four, five, and then a cobblestone wall. Cut that out, because we don't need those anymore. And then, and then, and then, and then, last but not least for this layer, we're going to, well, for me, I'm using these, uh, type of these colors for my roller doors so they're like uh i don't know what they are but which <laughs> but we're, i'm going to use them or you can use whatever you want as a roller door and a white and a white block that's up to you but what we're going to do on the inside of this we're going to skip up we're going to go in a block and we're going to go four one two three four actually it's going to be five I'm going to double check that oh no it's because i got double blocks that's why so we're going to cut that off. We're going to add two blocks there, like so. So two blocks on the inside, and then four. One, two, three, four. And then our white block. And then what you're going to do next is you're going to copy this to the other side. You're going to flip it over. And then we'll just do the next layer, because the next layer is pretty easy. So the next layer, we're going to put two blocks on top of here. We're going to come past these. We're going to put a block here, here, and here, like so. We're going to go down to here. Two blocks in here. This run runs back to the end. And then we're going to have two in there. We're going to continue our roller door for our hangar bay. We're going to build that up by one. Build our cobblestone blocks up by our cobblestone walls up by one. And then we're going to build up our stairs by one. Like so. And that is literally it for that layer. So now that we've got that, you're going to copy that. You're going to copy those two layers to the other side if you haven't already. And then we're going to continue on with the next layer. Okay, so this... I forgot to build the other side. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to do the next... Um, we're going to do the next layer. So what we're going to do next... I was about to say, this is what we should have, but um, I clearly don't. So what we're going to do next is we're going to come to here. We're going to come out four blocks, so two, four. Like so, we're just going to have four blocks going out. You're going to put one in connecting that. And then you're going to go to your stone, you're going to grab your stone slabs. You're going to... Yeah, you're going to grab your stone slabs and you're going to place one on the on the edge, like that, on the end. So you should have five blocks in here, and then a slab on the end. That slab is going to go back six in total. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six. Should be in line with that. We're then going to have 19 going back. So you're going to have two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 19. Like so. You're going to add two on the inside. Then you're going to add your staircase going up. 
and in here we're going to grab our actually no i won't do that yet um what we're going to do next is we're going to build up our two by two here and then we're going to grab our dark gray block from here we're going to do a we're going to go eight blocks back so we're going to go one two three four five six seven eight we're going to run that to the middle And then we're just going to fill this in pretty much for now. So we're just going to pretty much fill this in all the way to the end of that eight run. So that should be an eight, eight by whatever the hell it is to the middle. And then on this corner, we're going to go three, we're going to go three out. And then we're just going to run that down, connect that into there. And then just fill that in in between like so i'm going to grab our stone we're going to run this run forward just to there for now and then we're going to build up our roller door for our hangar bay like so so it should be four and then one white and that is this layer completed. Is there anything I missed for this layer? No. No. Anything on this side? Nope. Okay, now that we have that, you got to copy that to the other side. And I'm going to copy the previous layer to the other side. And we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, so this is what you should have now. What we're going to do next is we're going to come down to this corner. We're going to bring, we're going to place down four iron bars going forward. So one, two, three, four, like so. We're going to go to our stone block. We are going to go 12 forward. So we're going to go two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. On the back, on the back end of this, we're going to go four across. One, two, three, four to there. Then this one's going to run to the end. I'm going to put two in there for now, like so. So it should be a three by three in this dark gray area here. We're going to add two iron bars there. And then we're going to come back here and we're going to make this one. It's going to be seven. So it's going to go in by seven. So we've got one. We've got one already. Then we've got two, three, four, five, six, seven, like so. And is that seven? Well, it's actually going to be eight. So it's going to be two, four, six, eight. Yeah, it's going to be eight. And then, so we're going to add one more to make that an eight. So it'll be two, four, six, eight in total. And then connecting to this one, we're going to add four. So we're going to go two, four. So this run will be eight. And then we're going to add four. And if you count that corner with this one connected, it'll make that one five in total. And then we're just going to run this to the middle for now. So we pretty much have that. What we're going to do now, we're going to build up our roller door again. And we're going to build what we just placed. We're going to build that up two more times. So we're going to go, this will be the first, we'll go one. So that's one and then we're going to do it again two so it should be a total height of three except for the the third one we're not going to build our roller door we're just going to run this across to the middle so i'm going to add five to the middle i'm going to cut this corner piece out this one that sticks out and if you want to, if you want more space in here, you can cut. Actually, in a way, you can't because that's. Never mind. I was going to say you could cut this out and then have some extra space in here, but you kind of can't. Yeah. You can build that wall up and just have like. This can be its own little compartment or something. Alright, what we're going to do next, though. What can we do next? I'm going to grab our dark gray wool and we're just going to. Pretty much run this forward. 
and then we're just going to fill this in for now. Just going to fill all of this in. Like so. We're almost finished. Just kind of realize that. <laughs> We're kind of getting to that finishing point soon. Got a bit more to do. But what we're going to do now is we're going to grab our stairs. And we're going to come to here. We're going to skip the first block on the second. We're going to put a stair. Then we're going to go up one. And then up one again, like so. We're going to put a block there and a block there for now. We're going to grab our tripwire hooks. We're going to grab a glass block and we're going to come to the we're going to come to here we're going to skip a block and we're going to place two tripwire hooks and then we're going to continue around to this corner and then we're going to drop down one to where these railings are we're going to cut them out replace them with glass and it's just sort of like it gives the illusion that there's a little the little glass room in there that they uh control landing helicopters and stuff from but reality is minecraft can't do it I'm gonna get a two. Okay. So for our buttons, we're gonna come down to the middle one, the middle one of these three. I'm gonna skip a block, add three, skip two, add three. Is it three or four? Not three. So yeah, on this so we're gonna skip one, place three, skip two, place three. Like so. Now what we can do next is we're just gonna clear out our inventory. We're just going to grab what we need for this rib. So we're going to need the black carpet, dark gray carpet, stone slabs, iron bars, dark gray concrete. Uh, we only need a stone block for now. Actually, we will. So we need to fix something. And we need the crane. And then fences. Okay, so before we can f start building this, we need to come under here. Cut two, four five out just these ones out and replace them with stone and then you're going to place a dark gray carpet here skip a block dark gray carpet uh, skip two I meant sorry we're going to place a dark gray carpet skip a block place two and then we're going to put a slab there slab there grab our black carpet run it back like so on here we're going to skip we're going to skip the middle one we're going to skip one place one skip one place one we're going to put a slab we're going to put a slab up there and then that's going to go forward by five so we get one two three four five we're going to grab our dark gray concrete we're going to place one there put one there there and there cut that off cut that one out of it this is going to go back five in total. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And then we're just going to place a block there. Grab a hopper. Place it going back like so. Three across, one there, one there. Two fences here, two fences there. Three connecting them like so. Grab our stone slabs, so just going to put a block in there, and then a slab on top. Carpet in there, three in there. Grab our iron bars, run them across here, connect them in there. Except, um, hold on, just bear with me one second. Yeah, no, that's what I thought. Okay, now what we're going to do next is we're going to grab our stone block. Right here, we're going to add three cut this one out, replace that with a block, and that one with a block, like so. Two blocks on top, one slab down here, and then it was five, I'm pretty sure, one, two, three, four, five, yep. Then five slabs going up diagonal, so one, two, three, four, five. So we've got five slabs going diagonal, so it'll be like that. And then 
fence there just for that sort of cable and that's that bit done and I'm just going to chuck one in what we're going to do here is we're going to come to here the second block we're going to cut out for a door like so actually I'm going to move that over a block just going to chuck in a door there and then now that we've got that um, pretty much when you copy the other side just pretty much have the one door like that so yeah now what you're going to do is actually we'll just take we'll just take a little bit of work off us now we're just before i say copy this to the outside we're just going to wrap around here with our iron bars just so we don't have to do it later we're just going to wrap around all the way to there it's pretty much on top and now what you're going to do is everything we just built you're going to copy that to the other side and we'll get on with the next layer. Well, we'll get on to the top pieces up here, so we'll get those now. Okay, so we're getting on to the last piece here, which is just the stuff on top of here. So what we're gonna start off by doing is we're gonna head down to this corner. Um, by the way, I accidentally copied that over, so don't copy that over. That one's just the glass that's gonna be on that side, on the opposite side, which is this side, the right-hand side of the ship. Right down in this corner, we're going to put down a cobblestone wall. We're going to put down a fence on top of it, and then another cobblestone wall, and then another fence, another cobblestone wall, and then a slab, like so. In the other corner, we're going to put down a cobblestone wall and a white skull going forward, like so. And then what we're going to do is you're going to grab a counting block, you're going to place a block. And then it is ba -ba -da -ba, one diagonal of that. We're going to have a slab like so. So we should have a two, we should have a one gap from here and a gap between them on that angle. And this is going to go forward by four like so. And I'm just going to make sure that it isn't cobblestone. No, it's not. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to go, we're going to put it in a Counting block diagonal. Then we're going to grab stone. And we're going to go one here. Cut that out. And then we're just going to make that a two forward. We're going to skip a block. Two going this way. This is your center line straight down the middle. So we're going to pretty much copy this to the other side as well. Two, four. So be like that. And then what do I have in between the middle of that? Just a block and then a fence on top. So we're going to have a block here, a fence on top, and then two cobblestone wall on this side, two cobblestone wall on this side. And then over here, we're going to grab our stone block. We're going to cut this iron bar out, replace it with a block. Same with this side. And then we're going to head to the front here. We're going to skip a block. Place a cobblestone wall, skip two blocks, cobblestone wall, skip two, cobblestone wall, like that. I'm going to do that on the other side as well. So I'm going to skip a block, one, skip a block, one, skip a block, uh, skip two blocks, sorry, and then skip two blocks, one. Like that. Over here, we're going to skip a block, cobblestone wall, skip a block, cobblestone wall. Like that. And then we just got these little bits in here and then our smokestacks okay so we're going to head to the middle here we're going to skip this block here then we're going to place three cobblestone wall going forward we're going to grab a counting block three wide across here three cobblestone on each corner like so then cut out our counting block And now that we have that, we are almost done. I'm just going to see where I started that from. It's going to be a gap of three. Okay, so we're going to head to our cobblestone walls on the side. We're going to leave a gap of three. And then we're going to place one, run that back, and it should be in line with this one. So it should be a total length of two, four, six, seven. So it'll be seven by three. 
we're going to do that on both sides. Three, and then to seven. So it should be seven by threes, like so. Once we have that, we're going to cut this one out and this one on the front. I'm going to replace those with black. Oh no, wait, is that on the front or the back? It's actually on the back. Sorry, that's on the back, not the front. So the back ones get replaced with black, not the front ones. Like so. We're then going to grab our stone. We're going to bring those to a height of three. So one. And then this makes two. And then three. So we bring those to a height of three. Do that on the other one as well. Height of three. And then height of three. Like so. So we should have that. We're going to grab our buttons. On the second one, we're going to skip a block. We're going to add three. Do it on the insides as well. Skip a block. Three. Skip a block. Three. And on here, skip a block. Three buttons. And that's what we should have so far. We're going to grab our cobblestone wall. We're going to put three going up here. Three going up here. And then we're going to put three blocks across here. This will be the seven run going back. So it should be seven by three. And then we're going to go, I'm um, just going to grab, get rid of that because I don't need that. We're going to grab a red block. We're going to put two blocks. This will be for the red kangaroo that sits on the side. And then four stone behind it. And then one black block. Do that on this side as well. And then build up your cobblestone wall. And then what we're going to do is we're just going to add three stone to the top end of this. Like so. Then one in there. One in there. One last cobblestone wall. And what we're going to do next is we're going to grab our black block. We're going to put four running down here. Four down here. Four down here. Four down here. One here. One here. And then three here. Three here. Three here. Three here. Three here. One there. One there like so, so it should be like that. Then we're going to grab our slabs. We're going to put two black slabs there, two black slabs there, two there, two there, three across the end here, three across this end, like that. And I just need to see what I did on the inside. If I've Yeah, I did. Okay, where well we got this second, where well we got this first set of two slabs here, we're going to put a black block there and a black block on the inside. We're going to grab our trap doors. We're going to put two at the bottom of there and then two at the bottom of that one. So it sort of just makes these vents like that. Or you can use fences if you want. Those will probably work as well. Actually, they'll probably work a bit better for you. I might drop those down a block. Yeah, you could do that or some raise them up. Up to you on that one. I'm just going to stick with what I got on the other one. Like that. And last but not least, we have to do two runs of two, four, six, seven iron bars. So we've got seven iron bars going up. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then this one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And last but not least, that finishes off this build. So if you use this in a server or a world, please do give me credit. I, sh I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I hope you find a use for this ship. And 
If you feel the video deserves it, hit that like button. It helps the channel out with the algorithms. Feel free to feel feel free to leave a comment down below if you'd like to request a build. Um, the information is in the description. If you want to join the Discord, that is also linked in the description. The texture pack is in the t Discord for those who want it. Hit that subscribe button if you're new around here or if you've been watching for a while. And besides from that, I'll catch you all later. Peace out.